Today, I'm going to show a story that's called Jessica. Jessica didn't like her bat and ball. She didn't li like her toy bear or toy cat. It's bad that she just didn't like her toys at all. She told her mother how she felt about toys. She said, I want to talk to you, Mum. I just don't like my toys. But her mum answered, I don't have time. At the moment, Jessica have things to do. You must like playing with your toys. So she went to her dad and said, Mama, talk to your dad. You see, I just don't like toys. I really like talking. And her dad answered, I don't have time at the mountain. Jessica, I sweeping your, you must like playing with your toys. And they replied, no, I don't sad. and you are playing with my toys. Not one little bit. I don't even want to keep them. Then go for a swim. Of course, said her dad. But Jessica didn't want to swim in the pool. She went all uh, away feeling sad. She went all away feeling sad. One day, Jessica's mom and dad wanted to go out. She Want to stay with a friend of her mom's. The friend had a son called Lee. Lee said, I am glad you have come. There are, are no toy boys or girls in my street. And I really like having someone to talk to. Jilly said, but you may not like being with me very much because I have no toys for you to play with. Jessica looks so happy, I don't like toys. One little bit, she replied, and I just love talking. I love doing things without them too. That's good, said Lee. I'm glad you came. I preferred to meet you. Let's cook some lunch together. This Jessica and such a good time was Lee and Lee had such a good time with Jessica, the children become good friends. Come back soon, little bit. I will, I will, said Jessica, and she did, she did, she felt perfect that Lee wanted to be with her. Lee liked Talking with Jessica, he liked to, to like it too when she helped him with his jobs. And Jessica loved to feel, feel watched. Bye, everyone. I have finished my story.